Hi, this is Kendra from Pencil Pigment, and today I'm doing my Monday morning plan with me. I have pre-colored this paper. This is the Tomoe River paper. This is the Hobonichi Weeks. It is Year of the Tiger on the Lunar New Year, February 1st. And this paper has such a slick surface, it takes a while to dry. And I tried to create a sort of ocean and stormy skies, sort of sunrise or sunset. And I used my Neo Color 2 from Karen Dosh. I used a little bit of my watercolor sticks from Pentel. And I have my back door open, which I shouldn't have because of noise. But my cats, the sun is out, so I'm trying to give them sunshine. And then I used a little bit of my Fiber Castell Polychromos to sort of create this. So today I'm going to plan the week. Are you ready? Okay. So today is the 10th. And if it's sneaking up on you, you're not alone. The days are sneaking up on me as well. Plan with me. And I hope you can see that last week's I did sort of in colored pencil and it looked really, really faint. Um, tomorrow I'm going to be doing art around the world. It's kind of a strange abbreviation, isn't it? And I'm still for the whole month of January, I'm doing India and I wanted to do Kolam art. And it's beautiful, and if you're not familiar, you'll see tomorrow. I'm very excited. Wednesday, oh yes. Sketchbook tour. I will be done with my watercolor sketchbook of birds. I am super excited. Super excited. Um, the next day is Thursday. Those are sort of my story times my create with me and those go up later in the evening just because of all the things we do with homeschool that day that's easier for me Friday I will be talking about the February artist creator challenges so and I do those mid-month for the next month. That way you have a couple weeks to sort of figure out what you want to do, what supplies you have. If you're running low on something and you need to pick something up. Um, if you're doing a no-buy, organize, go through your inventory, shop your stash. Saturday, I take Saturdays off. That's where I kind of get things ready for the next day. I charge my camera battery. <laughs> um, Sunday is my no-buy art supply. And I am doing an in-depth topic. And I have a couple to choose from. I'm not sure. I may do one. I may do both. And just spend five minutes on each. I'm not sure. So this is what the week is going to look like and you can decide where you want to spend your time what you're interested in I know a lot of people um, are really interested in my no buy some folks only like sketchbook tours so and some people only like just me hanging out chatting while I draw and that's you know it's a little something for everybody so I'll lay this out in advance you can see what's coming up ahead if you're interested in anything if you're not that's okay too I'm gonna try and draw little little birds in the sunset at a distance maybe we'll see it's very slick doing micron over these neo color twos so 
I'm going to get really good at sort of knowing what works and doesn't work with layering on this product, doing this product on all these pages, which is awesome because I've had this product for so long, those Neo Colors, and I wasn't using them, which is such a waste. Anyway, how was your Monday? How are you doing? Are you getting things done? Are you motivated? Are you planning your week ahead? Do you like your weeks to be a surprise? <laughs> I understand some folks like surprises. Bird. Some of these birds are closer than others. That's the illusion we're gonna give. Anyway. I hope your Monday is wonderful. I hope it's productive. I hope it's relaxing. I hope you get done the things you need to get done. I hope there are moments of peace and joy. I clearly have <laughs> a huge love of birds. It's undeniable at this point, isn't it? Anyway, it's always remind me when I draw birds like silhouette flying. They always remind me of sort of like fighter jets from science fiction films. Like, is that where they get their shape inspiration from? Anyway, doing the brown with the blue it's a little softer and I like that combination of pale blue with brown I also like um, dark brown with pale pink or pale green I think it looks really cool anyway there we go there's the week ahead I hope that helps I hope you have a wonderful day. I will link all the products I'm using in the description box below. And I will talk to you tomorrow. Bye.